Good morning, everybody. Welcome to my creative time with Emma. And also, welcome to another Inspiration Wednesday. I am super excited to get back to my video, my videoing. Yesterday, I was really bummed because I was, thought I was doing a video. And I kept thinking, why isn't this making any... Does Not that it makes noises, just nothing was happening. And I didn't realize that I had left my camera on from the last time after I actually... Um, charged up and everything. Well, I had, unfortunately, I left it on. I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, and the thing is, I don't understand why it did not turn off by itself, because it's supposed to have that feature, but uh, maybe there was a malfunction somewhere in there. But anyways, um, I wasn't able to do a video last night, but I am tonight. I make sure when I, when I woke up, I charged my, my uh, camera, so thank God. Okay, so anyways, for today... I am making something that was inspired um, from me. Um, let me find. I had gone to Hobby Lobby not too long ago, and I took a picture of this display. Now, I'm not sure if it's allowed or not, but I did because I was very intrigued by the colors. So I said, you know what? If we have another inspiration soon, whatever inspiration day soon, I'm definitely going to use these. So I'm going to take like the grays, the blues, the, I'm not sure if it's like a peach or like a melonish color, but super cute. That's what I'm using as my inspiration. Okay. So let me grab the stamp set too. Let me just show you everything we're going to use today. We're using my build a Chevy background, um, my three by four, um, stitch journal card die. Which, by the way, I got tons of these in, and my mother just informed me that I only have a few left. So this is a huge, huge seller. So I'm definitely, definitely going to be placing another order for these, okay? Um, so anyways, I also am using Build-A-Banner. I'm not using any of the dies this time. I'm actually going to be using the little polka dot uh, stamp background. And then I'm using this big ginormous set, but I'm only using one item from here. Bloom where you are planted. I'm going to be using this one right here. Thanks a bunch. Um, and then the colors that I'm using for this is going to be Soft Cantaloupe. Um, so this one right here by Hero Arts, Soft Cantaloupe, uh, Soft Granite. And this one's here by Ranger. This one's called Aquamarine. These were the closest of the colors that I thought would look good. Okay, so I'm, oh, you know what I forgot to tell you I used as well? Um, let me grab them from here. I used my little stitch file folder and index card die. Along with this die, I need to investigate to see what um, die set this goes with. Um, but I'll have a link to it on my blog, okay? So anyways, that's all the stuff I used. So what I did, I actually um, stamped my little file folder already, so all I have to do is just put it together, but I will do that after. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to, I was thinking of using, hmm, let's see, I think I want to use the thicker one for this right here. Yeah, let's use the thicker one before I change my mind. Let's go ahead and just put this down here. All right, so what I'm gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and use um, soft granite for this. And I'm just gonna go ahead and just ink it up really, really well here. Now these do kinda come on a little blotchy, these shadow inks, but they actually dry pretty nice, pretty um, clear. I never do a practice stamp, um, but I'm going to do one today only because this is the first time I'm using this set right here. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just do this again. Okay, so now it's ready. Let me go ahead and go ahead and get this inked up all over again. Okay, that should do her. Okay, I always love that 
your the inks are nice and juicy. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and start. Um, let's start right here. Now I know I should have probably put a paper underneath here, and I forgot. I can't find anything. My little my what do you call that grid mat? I don't know what I did with it. How long? <laughs> don't ask me how I could lose that, but unfortunately I did. Okay. I, not that I lost it. It's just that I put. I'm trying to um, pick up everything on my desk, and you know I probably just sat it down somewhere. I'm pretty sure once I go through the rest of my room, it will show up. Like I said, I don't know how I lost that big old 18 inch by 14 inch. I think it was grid mat. <laughs> But only me, right? Okay, so I'm going to just keep on inking this up. And I'm going to do the same thing um, all the way down. Um, put that like so. So like I said, I'm going to do the same thing all the way down. I don't want to bore you uh, by having you watch me. Uh, what do you call that? <laughs> Stamp the whole thing, okay? It's all Okay, huge change of plans. I landed up switching to the smaller little um, Chevy die. Be I mean, not die. What do you call these little thingies? The uh, stamp. Because the bigger one, I just wasn't really feeling it. Because when I put my little polka dot up to it, the other ones were so huge that you could barely even see that it was an actual, you know, a little chevron die. Um, so keep saying die, stamp, I just stamp, stamp, stamp. Okay, so anyways, what I'm going to do, I am going to put my little cutie patootie file folder together here. And all I do is I just um, put this, oopsie, right here. And then we grab my scissors. I'll just go ahead and give it a little trimmy trim there. Just like so. And then I'm just going to go ahead and see that's why I didn't stamp this all the way down here because I knew it was going to get covered. Alright, so let's go ahead and just line this up. Gotta keep, you know what I should have did? I would have been, I should have cleaned my hands after, darn it, after I did that last, because I have gray ink on my hands. It's getting on my little poor file folder here. There we go. Alright, so. Basically, that's what it's going to look like, and this is going to go probably like so, just like that, okay, oopsie, I'm trying to figure out here, I'm going to need something to click, a little pin to close it, in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and stamp my sentiment, thanks a bunch, onto my little arrow die here, but I did want to kind of put this Kind of going up and having this just like that. There we go. Oh, that looks really cute. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go ahead and pop that little bad boy up there because I want it to look bigger. So let's go ahead and put that there, that there, put two more on here. I'm going to go ahead and get these popped, my million pop dots on here really quick. Okay, so this is just going to go like so. Thanks a bunch. Um, and let me grab, I want to get a cute little clip. Let me grab something really fast. Okay, I am going to use these little, there's a few clips all kind of uh, mixed up in here. I'm going to use this little, they're called little library clips. And I'm just going to go ahead and just put that right there just to keep it closed. I think that looks really cute. And then this I'm going to go ahead and pop up like so. But you know what? It's missing something right here. I don't want to make this video any longer than what it is. So what I'm going to do, what should I do? 
Let me go ahead and throw some of this behind it. I'm going to go ahead and just pop this up, but not too high because I'm thinking it needs a flower down at the corner there, don't you think? I think so. So let me put this like so. So that, oh yeah, that's perfect. Pop a little pop up right there. Oops. Okay, so I'm going to probably do something like that, and I think I'm going to add a little flower right there, and then I'm going to go ahead and... Um, either put it on a card or make it into a tag. I'm so sorry. I just, um, this is why I can't do stuff like, you know, at the spare of the moment. I thought I knew, thought I knew what I wanted to make, but apparently not. And I don't want to keep you any longer. So you'll see what the final product looks like, um, at the end of the video. So thank you so much for tuning in everybody. And I will see you back here tomorrow. Have a fabulous day, everybody. Bye-bye.